I'm Tam. And I'm Bob. Welcome to our adventure. We made it to breakfast on day two. We're at Coco Cay. Tam has got the market breakfast bowl. Vegetable. Vegetable breakfast bowl. Breakfast bowl. But with egg. With egg. And I got the egg white omelet with ham, tomatoes, peppers, and cheese, and a bowl of muesli. We're going to have breakfast, and we are going to go to the schooner bar and read and do some trivia. We're at Coco Cay. Freedom of the Seas is next to us. I don't know if you can see it through the windows. But I could detect that they were freedom because I saw their Wi-Fi. <laughs> so I haven't actually been outside the ship yet to see, but uh, I know Freedom's next to us. And we are at Perfect Day at Coco Cay. So before breakfast, Tam went down to the Promenade Cafe and got his coffee. Well, one, look how they spell her name. No, I'm going. Not okay. So, coffee will do? It was tasted like warm well, almond milk, and I'm not doing it again. I'll have black tea in the dining room because that's disgusting. We only put one. We only put one shot in it. We think. Even, even, not even one shot. shot like that in a large cup. It's meant to be at least two. Yeah. Kind of a bummer, but oh well. Don't get coffee at Promenade Cafe on Independence in the morning, at least. We are on deck two forward. We're waiting for the uh, loyalty ambassador to open up at 9 o'clock, so we have 11 minutes. We're just going to hang out in these chairs to get us, which is nice. It's also where the conference center is on Independence of the Seas. I tried to convince NASA to have a concert conference on a cruise ship one time. It did not go over well. Where am I? I'm still on deck two in the, in the front of the conference center. I'm just looking up at the elevators and the forward end of the ship and the walkway and the stairs to walk down from deck four to deck three, which is right above us where the Royal Theater is. So here at Perfect Day Coco Cay, Freedom of the Seas sitting next to us. Independence of the Seas and Freedom of the Seas, two Freedom of the Seas class vessels here today. Freedom of the Seas is out of Miami doing basically the same itinerary we are. They'll probably be at NASA tomorrow, possibly. And then, um, so will we. We'll be at NASA tomorrow, and we're going to go to the schooner bar and do trivia most of the day, probably, so that's where we'll be. Let's get it on now with our morning trivia question number one. Question number one, what is the fastest animal in the world? So it's deck seven, we're our deck. From the forward end of the ship, looking down the promenade, you can see the elevators go by left and right. Uh, our room is about between four, the fourth flag and the fifth flag down on the right. Up on deck 11 on Independence of the Seas, they have fish and chips. Uh, or I'm getting a battered sausage. I'm going to go with what they say it's a blue Hawaiian. They claim it's because there's more pineapple than I think it's less sour than this. It was just a dab of blue curacao, so... For lunch today, Tim got the fish and chips. With the blue Hawaiian. I got the battered sausage with some chips. It's not blue Hawaiian. Um, fish and chips. Some fish and chips, I'm delighted. Of course, one of the best things on cruise ships. The soft serve. up here in the Viking Lounge, just kind of watching the world go by. <clears throat> you can see the two ships that are here, Independence and Freedom of the Seas. They're sister ships, but they're a little different. You see, Freedom is the one over, is the farther one, obviously, because we're on Independence here. But Freedom has got the little huts up on Deck 12 that are pay huts, whereas Independence doesn't have those yet. Otherwise, it's pretty similar. They both have the Splash Away Bay, and Splash Away Bay, get the main pool and the main pool. But it also like covers over near where the um and it's got a different raised area. Yeah. And it's got covers and stuff all Yeah, it's like got like the little palm, and the palm, palm trees, trees and stuff that this one doesn't have. So And it doesn't have the three tiered diamond area. No. Um sweets area, I mean. That's a sweets area here, oh, those yeah. three tiers of chairs. Okay. They don't have that. They've only got two levels. And I don't think they have 
the raised area near the solarium, but the solarium is different. Yeah, and they've got, if you look in the very front, they've got palm trees up there. They're the same, they both have the but same different. Stars. Pam's going to read her book for a while. I'm probably going to just watch the world go by up here. Uh, Tribon Trivia is at 2 o'clock. That's our next thing we're going to go do. I'm going to walk around and show you Deck 14. This is the Viking Lounge. It's also the club at night. During the day, it's very peaceful and quiet. Right now, there's hardly anybody up here other than us. The bar, bar on this ship opens at 4, usually. On Mariner, they opened earlier. So it's a nice space. Nice dance floor area for the club. And what we're going to show you is, is the Diamond Club. The Diamond Club. Cocktails, you should be here for birds and things at night. There's a diamond concierge. You see this nice space. And you have seats. This is also bad during the day. The Diamond Club also has an area back here. Outside. does not. So I guess a different circle. I'm going to see about getting Tam some coffee. See if they fix the latte machine. Latte. Let's see how this works. And we're getting ready for our spirited coffees. Hi. Hi. Can I please get a large um, almond milk latte? It's your latte. With Bailey's and Grand Marnier. Yeah. Almond milk? Yeah. Almond milk. Almond milk. Grand Marnier. And an extra shot of coffee to make it stronger coffee. Mm -hmm. Do a double shot. Hmm? Like a double shot. Like a triple shot. Triple shot. Afternoon snack. It's just a caramel something. A caramel pot of something. No sugar added. No sugar added. Okay, can you take this? All included on Royal. For free. Plus some cookies, chocolate chip and... Coconut Ranger cookies, my favourite. Coconut Rangers. And spirited coffee. And I got spirit of coffee as well with, I got mine with Bailey's and Jameson. First, Tam goes with the Bailey's. Grand Marnier. And Grand Marnier. So, it's snack time. Before we head to Tribon, just kind of catching this because you can see the cow's reflection in the mirror. Okay. But the cows are actually behind me. Ben and Jerry's. We started at the Promenade Cafe, but it's Michael Kors. Watch shop. You want to go get watches? Very pretty Northern car. Very nice Northern car. A couple of teddy bears driving it. Vintages, the wine bar. Vintage is a very nice wine bar. At least it was when we were here in December. Beauty store. Beauty store. The stairway goes down into the casino, like most of them do. There's an ale and anchor. The table from the front that shows the casino royale stairway. There's the casino royale. There's the stairway going down. The club. What's shopping there? <laughs> Generally, don't go to refill your drink package with sodas. You have a drink package? You have a drink package? 
with the market on the left, it's as alcohol and tobacco nice. products and oh. Caribbean. And when we're not at Coca Cola, Sorrento's is open, getting slices of pizza. Under hours. For this sailing, they are open at 2 p.m., which is an hour from now. And until 3 a.m., they're open. So, this is where the club party crowd go after partying, at least. We hear that from at least several people, one of which being Jordan. <laughs> and then ahead of Starlight Lounge, we won't go there right now, but... You want to go? No. No. Especially if the stock is still there. The Star Lounge. Oh, There's actually a library. Alright. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. There's a library. Mm -hmm. There's computers for IP. And they have books once again. I hope they're not thinking yesterday after Select the book and read it. You can return books. It's a nice little place too. The deck is still laid. Everybody found it. We found it. Look up on the top shelf. It's a Minecraft duck. Still out there. Let's see how long he stays. Well, not a lot of people come in the library. It's a nice little area. The earrings are gone. Pam's been doing abandoned art with her earrings that she's made. Thank you. where they do karaoke at night. They also have some game shows in here. Some of the bigger trivia, like Harry Potter trivia is up in here. Got an exit to the outside. There's still a deck over here. And the earrings. And the earrings. Let's see how long they Last week, eight I figured found. when people come in here later today, yeah. it'll be found. And I figured I'd put it in the corner because that's where I'd hide. <laughs> so that's most of the five. The other side. There's a bar at night. There's a bar at night. While we're waiting for Tribon Trivia to start here in the Schooner Bar on deck four, I'll show you the rest of deck four. In the front, you get the Royal Theatre. This is the upper deck of the Royal Theatre. The lower deck's on deck three. You got these scoop seats over here for the schooner bar, which leads right into the Casino Royale. Isn't, isn't active right now because we're adopted. Perfect day, cook, okay? Actually, it is active. I stand corrected. People in here playing, playing roulette, and cards, 21, playing stop machine. Apparently you're not allowed to film in the casino when it's running, so I got in trouble there a little bit. But after a casino, you get to Playmakers, which is a bar, a restaurant, a pub, a pool tables, and those kind of games. Tons of TVs with every sports channel, every sport you can think of. Playing your playmakers. After playmakers, you get Boleros, which is a Spanish nightclub. We usually have a live band here at night. And they have the bar. Always have the big card chair. Get three below, which wouldn't do that a little bit. 
Ini saya pegang ni. Also dining room, the four ends of the dining room. There's dining rooms on deck five, deck four, and deck three. Our dining room is actually on deck four. Which is this one, just straight away. So that's Boleros. We're at a biking lounge. Tonight is dress your best. Tam is looking pretty good. This is my best. <laughs> this is as good as you get today. This is my best. We're still at Coco Cay. I think we're leaving soon. Everyone seems to be back on board. So, doing big smash. Citron mule. Citron mule. Citron mule, which is like a vanilla. Citr what is citron? A citrus vodka. Citrus vodka. With lime juice and ginger beer. With citrus vodka with lime juice and ginger beer. And I have a Goombay Smash, which is two types of rum, pineapple, and coconut juice, I think. We're still at Coco Cay, okay, but we're getting ready to leave soon. And not too bad here. It was, this place was a zoo on Mariner, but this is pretty nice. I just blew the horn, so I think we're leaving where they are. I'm not sure which horn it was. Was that our horn or Freedom's horn? Now? That's what I was thinking. I can't see the doctor see who's got their mind so it was, it was us, we're moving. You can finally barely see it removed from the corner away from the dock. And then we're going to start moving forward, which will be up that way. So Freedom was there when we got here, I think, wasn't it? So we, we got here last and we they're leaving here. Awesome. What's the spray to go at? Oh, what did I? I like freedom better than independence. Like I said, I like that in the promen promenade, they have the thing that's like a jumping in the yeah. pool. Diving down. They're very similar. Well, I want to Mind you, the golden lamp they have. Everyone's out on their balcony watching this guy. He's got a big hand, the guy in the actual front. He's got a big hand waving. The huh? crew member in the uh, front. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's waving a big hand. One second ago. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's waving a big hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There he is. There he is. Imagine having the middle panoramic suite. That would be cool. Well, we're off. We have left Coco Cay. And is out of her citrine rule. Citron. Citron. Tomorrow, the ship docks at Nassau. We're not getting off. We're not getting off. So the Viking.
parking lounge is really full, so we've moved to the pub. And, uh, continue to drink. drink. Continue to drink. And we've got another citrine, citron mule. Citron mule. And I switched over to whiskey sour with uh, Johnny Walker. So, for people watching out here in the promen middle of the promenade, so you've got the stairs to the Casino Royale. You've got the whole promenade area there heading towards the dinner. And you've got the promenade going the other way, heading towards Sorrento's Pizza, or Star Lounge, or Schooner Bar, or the Royal Theater for our activities coming up tonight. So, anyway, we're just people watching, hanging out in the promenade. Looking out the water, waiting for dinner. Beautiful sunset. We look over here. As we are getting close to the end of day two, we still have dinner to go to. Which I think our table is actually right there. That's our table. That is Nobody's there for first seating, so it's our table. Some of the interesting artwork on Independence of the Seas. So at dinner tonight, I ordered the Caesar salad, and then I upgraded to the chopped filet mignon, which is always good, with baked potato and peppercorn sauce, and then got the Grand Monet souffle with carrot cake to go to bring back to the room. I got the pumpkin soup, the coca van, and the Grand Monet souffle. Perfect. And when they come, we'll show you what they look like. Caesar salad, like always. Pam has gotten the pumpkin soup. As always. As always, whenever there's pumpkin soup available. Yeah. What do you call your chicken? Pokemon. Pokemon. Which is chicken of wine. Chicken of wine? Yeah, okay. Coco Vaughn. Yeah. 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 Yeah.